As Michigan law states to date, convenience stores must have $250,000 worth of non-alcoholic inventory to be able to sell beer and wine. But a legislation that sits on Governor Rick Snyder's desk would allow grocery stores with nearby gas stations to sell beer and wine at the on-site convenience store, even if it doesn't reach the $250,000 minimum inventory level. Republican Representative Eric Nesbitt introduced this legislation, saying it will open the market. However, the majority of Northern Michigan representatives vote against this because they see it as a carve out for Meyer and other big box stores. Now I'm not necessarily or personally against stores like Meyer moving to Northern Michigan and employing people, but I want a level playing ground for all to be able to enjoy Michigan's business. And this particular legislation, I truly believe it will be putting our small mom and pops at a tremendous disadvantage. Representative Patelia says if these big box store gas stations want to be able to sell wine and beer, the state should make it available for others as well. So he put in an amendment to this legislation that would lower the inventory level to $50,000. That way the majority of northern Michigan stores that desire to sell beer and wine would be able to do it also. However, it was immediately gaveled down, but he will continue to give voice to the small independent operators who might lose out if Governor Snyder signs this into law.